WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, everybody. This is Jacob Shoup filling in for Tom O'Brien. This is the 4 p.m. stock market update. I hope you all had a good day. Uh, during Tom's show that I was filling in for, we had Basil Chapman on. Make sure you check out our YouTube channel at the end of the day here. That is Tiger Financial News Network, and you can re-watch that segment I had with him. Make sure to give that video a like and our channel a subscribe. It helps us out immensely. Take a look right now where we ended up out of the day. Composite up about 1.45%. Dow Jones Industrial up about 0.30%. Uh, the dollar staying somewhat sideways, but still trading higher on that counter trend bounce at 102. Uh, 4090 of the E mini up about 0.93. And then crude is dropping on uh, some news that it might not escalate between Israel and Iran in ways uh, that some people had anticipated, which would be good for everyone. Silver off about 3.37%, trading at 3093. And that gold contract off to about 0.9%, uh, trading at 2,641. Disney doing its thing, which is not a lot, but it has been doing a lot better recently, which is kind of nice. And still dynamics off about 2.34%. Uh, and some other news, uh, crypto.com is suing SEC chair Gary Gensler after receiving a notice. Uh, pretty insane. The court filing was made to quote, protect the future of crypto in the US. This is the CEO had said in a posting on X, the suit is quote, a warranted response to the SEC's regulation by, uh, by enforcement regime, which has hurt more than 50 million American crypto holders. The Wells Notice was sent to crypto on August 22, excuse me, August 22nd. Let me see here, anything else? SEC has been regulating the crypto sector through a series of enforcement activities. Of course, so we'll see what kind of uh, comes out of that. Uh, the thing I really want to talk about, which I thought was kind of interesting, was something I was listening to with like Kai Rizdahl. Apparently the CIA has this contract um, with a non-for-profit investment group called IQT. And uh, so it's like, the, it's not actually the CIA, but uh, you know, they work really close with each other in a chartered agreement. Uh, but it's called IQT.com. You can kind of see what these guys are investing in. You know, I'm not going to say like, it's the CIA investing because, uh, you know, legally it's it's not. But this is kind of interesting stuff. IQT. We got Scadillo, Capilla, Bounce Imaging, FireEye. Kyoto Fusioneering, super interesting kind of stuff. Might have some fun uh, reading through that tomorrow, folks. Thank you so much for joining me. Again, we're gonna be gone tomorrow and Thursday. If anything changes, we'll keep you all posted. If you're in Florida, from one Florida man to another, be safe, okay? We'll see you then.